Brazil, a nation renowned for its vastness and variety of landscapes, has played host to several large-scale initiatives meant to advance sustainable development, enhance infrastructure, and spur economic progress. Brazil has demonstrated its ability to be inventive and resourceful via projects ranging from massive infrastructure projects to environmental conservation efforts. The nation has built the Transoceanic Highway, expanded the Sao Paulo Metro, developed renewable energy sources like the Belo Monte Dam, and established protected areas like the Amazon Rainforest Reserves, among other initiatives. These initiatives have a big impact on the world and the area in addition to helping the nation prosper. With its abundance of resources, dynamic culture, and dedication to advancement, Brazil continues to embark on transformative projects that shape its future and leave a lasting impact on the global stage. Welcome back to our YouTube channel and thank you for joining us. In this video, we will be highlighting 10 major projects that are contributing greatly to the economy of Brazil. If you are new to this channel, do well to like and share the video and hit that subscribe button to join our channel. Number 10, Vibra Imram Residential Complex. The project involves the construction of the Vibra Imram Residential Complex in Imram, Sao Paulo. The complex consists of two towers with a total of 259 units and five elevators. Its parking has a capacity of 94 cars and 12 motorcycles. This complex is intended to serve as a residential area as well as a commercial center. The complex contains playgrounds, party rooms, pools, and game rooms among others. The project aims to provide enhanced living facilities in the region. Construction work started in the second quarter of 2023 and is expected to be completed in the last quarter of 2024. Number 9, Sorocaba St. Remy Residential Complex. The project involves the construction of a residential complex in Sorocaba, Sao Paulo. The project is said to consist of a residential area integrated with a shopping center, the first of its kind in the area. The complex is also said to consist of facilities such as playgrounds, mini markets, game rooms, party rooms, pools, fitness centers, and sports courts. The objective of the project is to provide enhanced living facilities for people in the region. Construction work commenced in the second quarter of 2023 and is expected to be completed in the second quarter of 2026. Number 8, Makey Airport Expansion and Modernization. Located in the Brazilian state of Rio de Janeiro, Makey Benedito Lacerda Airport, also referred to as Makey Airport is a tiny regional airport serving the city of Makey. The airport offers passenger and cargo aviation transportation and is a major center for offshore oil and gas operations in the Campos Basin. The project involves the modernization and expansion of the airport in Meiki, Rio de Janeiro. The modernization will see the construction of a new terminal of approximately 6,000 square meters. It is also projected to increase passenger capacity from 200,000 to 1.2 million per year. The project aims to provide enhanced transportation facilities for passengers in the region. Construction work started in the second quarter of 2023 and is forecast to be completed in the last quarter of 2025. Number 7, Cabo Branco Tourism Complex. The Cabo Branco Tourist Hub, the greatest planned tourist hub in Joao Pessoa, Paraíba, Brazil, covers an area of 654 hectares with 35 lots, 19 of them for the hotel sector, one for the entertainment sector, one for commercial and services, and one for the events sector. The project includes a conventional center with a capacity of up to 20,000 people. In its four main buildings, among which stands out one of the most modern theaters in Brazil, with a capacity for 3,000 spectators, the Pedra do Reino Theater. Through this tourist complex, the state government works to make Paraíba stand out not only through cultural tourism, sun, and beach, business, and events but also as a reference in sustainable tourism presenting to the tourist the concern for the environment, the society, and the economy of Paraíba. Construction work commenced in the second quarter of 2023 and is expected to finish by the end of 2025. The objective of the project is to provide enhanced leisure and living facilities for people in the region. Number 6, Lenkois Paulista Tissue Factory Expansion. The project involves the expansion of a paper production plant with a production capacity of 240,000 tons slash year to 3 million tons slash year at Lenkois Paulista in Sao Paulo. This project is expected to generate more than 2,000 jobs during its construction phase and approximately 300 permanent jobs after its completion. Construction work started in 2023 and is expected to be completed in 2024. 
The project aims to generate economic and social development in the region. Number 5, Bachikadu Ceramic Tiles Factory. The project involves the construction of a ceramic tiles plant formerly called Duratex now Dexco in Bachikadu, Sao Paulo. The company's plan is intended to sustain the productivity and production of bathroom furnishing, tiles, and wood. Construction work started in Q2 2022 and is expected to be completed in Q4 2023. The project aims to increase the production capacity and offer complete solutions to consumers and customers. The unit will produce the Susa and Portinari brands large format ceramic slabs, which can be used in countertops and facades. Number 4, Aerocruise Industrial Port Terminal. The project involves the construction of an industrial port terminal on an area of 35.4 hectares at Barra do Riacho, Aerocruise, Esirado Santo. The port is said to consist of three terminals and a potential of 1 million TEU per year. Upon completion, the site will be an option for the flow of grain production, provision of support services for cargo import and export, loading and unloading of containers, vehicles, solid, liquid, and gaseous bulks, and offshore support. In addition to the direct and indirect jobs created during the execution of the works, the expectation is the implementation of about 25,000 jobs in the port and logistics production chain after the beginning of the port's operational activity. Construction work commenced in 2022 and is expected to be completed in 2025. The objective of the project is to accommodate the 60,120-meter length of vessels in the port with a handling capacity of 2,000 tons per year. Number 3, Oeste Cerrito Wind Power Plant. The project involves the construction of a 247.5 MW wind power complex in Pariljas, Rio Grande do Norte. Located in the municipality of Pariljas, the complex will span 10 wind farms featuring a total of 55 turbines with 6 generating units of 4,200 kW each. Once up and running, Oeste Cerrito should be capable of generating enough power to meet the consumption needs of close to 804,000 households. Construction work started in 2022 and is forecast to complete in 2024. The objective of the project is to generate electricity from renewable sources to meet demand in the domestic market. Number 2, Araquara Brewery Plant. The project involves the construction of a brewery plant on an area of 26.2 hectares in the municipality of Araquara, Sao Paulo. This is the project of the Spanish company Estrella Galicia and the first out of Spain. With the new plant in Araquara, the projection is to create up to 400 jobs. Products will be supplied to the surrounding nations and the domestic market from this plant located in the countryside of Sao Paulo. The choice of Araquara has to do with the quality of the product. The city is located in the region of the Guarani Aquifer, one of the largest freshwater reserves in the world. Its location allows for easy distribution of the production, including export routes. The objective of the project is to develop a brewery plant to meet the growing market demand in the country and produce 1.5 billion liters of beer per year. Construction work commenced in 2022 and is expected to finish in 2023. Number 1, Maraba Steel Plant. The project involves the construction of a steel plant in Maraba, Para. The unit will have an initial capacity to produce 250,000 tons per year of green pig iron, with the possibility of reaching 500,000 tons in the future. In the implementation phase of the project, which will work in the area of the old Ferrogusa Carajas, in the industrial district of the municipality, it is estimated that around 2,000 jobs will be generated at the peak of the works. In the operational phase, about 400 direct and indirect jobs should be created, according to progress and engineering studies. Construction work started in 2022 and is expected to be completed in 2025. The project aims to transform steel plates into 300,000 tons of rolled coils per year. These are just a few of the many mega-projects that are currently underway conclude our list of 10 mega-projects in Brazil. Thank you for watching to the end. Please do well to leave a review and comment on what you think about this video. Until next time, stay safe.